Among the Lakota people near the end of the 19th century, believers in the ghost dance religion thought that if they danced, a Messiah would come, the settlers would disappear, and the buffalo would return. Many wore special garments known as ghost shirts. They believed that the shirts would protect them, even from bullets. In December 1890, a band of Lakota traveling from the Cheyenne River Reservation to Pine Ridge were overtaken by the U.S. Army's 7th Cavalry. The band, with ghost dancers among them, was escorted to a campsite near Wounded Knee Creek. They were told to surrender their weapons. On December 29th, while the Lakota were being disarmed, a shot was fired, and within less than an hour, 200 Lakota men, women, and children lay dead or dying. A mini kanju man who fell at Wounded Knee wore this ghost shirt fringed and made of muslin with eagle feathers and metal discs. The shirt is now on display at the State Cultural Heritage Center in Pierre.